Hello everyone. Today let's discuss on urea clearance test. So urea clearance test along with it, uh, its significance. So first you can give the definition for urea clearance. Urea clearance is a number of ml of blood which contains the urea excreted in a in a minute by the kidneys. It is the number of ml of blood which contains urea excreted in a minute by the kidneys. It is calculated by the formula u into v by p where u is the is equal to milligram of urea per ml of urine p is the m milligram of urea per ml of plasma and v is the ml of urine excreted per minute. This is called maximum urea clearance and the normal value is around 75 ml per minute. So its significance you need to interpret the urea clearance value. If the value is below 75 percentage of the normal it is considered to be abnormal. So the value which is having a 75 if it is lying below 75 percentage of the normal it is giving a, an abnormality of the kidneys. The value fall progressively with falling renal function. The clearance value may be abnormal even though the plasma urea levels are within the normal limits. The plasma urea values will start to rise only when the when the clearance value falls below 50 percentage of the normal. Urea is normally reabsorbed from the renal tubules and therefore the tubular function also affects the urea clearance. Hence the creatine clearance test is more preferred because it has been reabsorbed from the renal tubules. It is normally reabsorbed from the renal tubules and the tubular function is also affects the uh, urea clearance. Creatine clearance is more preferred. Creatine clearance test. Then urea is freely filtered by the glomerulus and passively reabsorbed in both PCT and DCT. Urea clearance is less than GFR. Okay, thank you.